Welcome to the feature video of WooCommerce Custom Order Status. WooCommerce comes with eight standard order statuses, which do not cover all situations of business encounters. And this is where this extension comes in. You can add custom order statuses according to your business needs. Let's create custom order status to see how it works. Go to the Order Statuses option. Click on Add Order Status option to create a status. Enter the name and slug of your status. Add description for internal use. You can customize the background and text colors. Add text or icon based status. You can enable customers to cancel order when the order is in this status. Specify order payment status. Enable this checkbox if you want to show the status in bulk order actions. Select if you want to exclude this status orders from sales reports. You can also choose to show or hide this status from customers. Click on Publish. You can add multiple order statuses like this, and once the statuses are added, you would be able to see these statuses appearing on the Order Detail page to let you assign the relevant status. These statuses will also appear in Orders Grid and under Bulk Action to let you manually assign these statuses to orders. You can export and import these statuses using a simple CSV file too. You can download the CSV format and while importing, you would need to make sure that the attached CSV is in the correct format. Go to Status Email to create notification rules to keep your customers informed about new order statuses. Enter the email subject and heading. Add the message that you want to include in the status email alert. Select the recipient to who you want to send this email. Specify from and to status. The extension will trigger this email when the status changes from, let's say, pending to shipped. Now let's go to the second important feature of this extension. Go to Automation Rules to auto-assign these statuses to different orders based on conditions. Add the title here for internal use. Select from status, for example, the current status of the order to match, and specify to status, for example, the new status that should be assigned. Configure the time interval here after which the orders with pending status will be changed to cancel. Just like time intervals, you can use order quantity and order amount range, product or categories in order, billing and shipping countries, user roles, order creation date range. Disable status notifications for customers or admin if you have created any from status emails. You can enable single or multiple conditions to match all of them to automatically switch order status. This is the end of the video. Thank you for watching.